the volume from the rest of Okay, we should be good now. Okay, let us know if we have audio. We do, we have audio. Let us know. Give us a thumbs up. All right, Rochelle Worth Price says no sound. Phyllis hmm. says no sound. No, that was before. Okay. Let's see if we so are. There should, be, there should be audio now. Do we have audio? Okay, do we have audio? Kitsy Demare, yes. Anna Maria, great sound now. Whoa. Leslie Welsh Larity, yes. We can hear you now. Anna Munford, we can hear you. The only thing we can hear is Paul. Anna Maria <laughs> Milani, thumbs up. The Wonder Boy himself, Bryce Wonders, game on. We okay. can hear you, Jillian Goldrich, and okay. And everybody else. So, you know, we sent out, we sent this out to lots of people. So I, I'm going to do my welcome again. Thank you, everybody, for joining us here at Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl for our pop-up weekend special. Uh, we are going to be here Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday at 6 p.m. And then we will have our regular 8 p.m. Um, Eastern show on Monday night. So it's going to be a jam-packed weekend. We kind of did this little impromptu thing on Monday where we did a pop-up. And it worked out so nicely that we wanted to keep going with it and sharing all the great fibers that we have with our friends and their friends. So I really hope that you shared this. And um, as I mentioned earlier, when we didn't have audio, thank you all for keeping me awake after our Thanksgiving dinner. I hope that you are sufficiently stuffed now that the turkey is no longer. And um, I look forward to a very interesting hour ahead. And I think Paul is going to tell us that some of the folks are on here, we're going to do our best to keep up with your comments, but we have lots of things to show you. So we may get a little behind. We'll do our best to catch up. Anna Maria Milani, hope I can be fast enough tonight. Get those fingers going. Leslie Welsh Flaherty, me too, Anna Maria. <laughs> well, uh, Anna Maria, I did put those yarns aside that you asked me for. So, uh, you know, we're, we're running low. And if there's something that you saw on the show, or that you see on the show tonight and you you weren't fast enough or you thought twice about it and then decided later on that you want it, just send me a message. And if it's still available, I'll be happy to put it aside for you and uh, to work that out with you. Uh, so here's how this is going to work for some of the folks, for any folks that are new or who will be joining us is I have a table full. Paul, you want to just span the table here? I don't want to. You have to. You have to. So we have lots of things. We have we have some new things from the other night. Well, you might want to go a little slower. We're giving them the teaser preview until you can show them yourself each of the yummy yarns. So we're gonna we're gonna hold different things up. We're gonna let you know how they're available. Some are available by full bags. Some are available individually. Um, so if they're individual, we'll let you know how many skeins we have, and you can let us know how many you want. And if it's a bag, you get the whole bag. So. Um, Rochelle Worth Price says a full hour. That's impressive! Exclamation point. Well, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, we don't have, we don't have a full hour worth of merchandise, but I think we might. I just think we might. Uh, so yeah, I don't know where to start. You know what? I have this fun little thing that I'm going to start with, and it's not even yarn. This is one of the cutest little bags that I that I, I've seen. This is this little bag says I'll pack in my bag. It's a little alpaca. This is a waterproof bag that we have. I have only one of these left. It's great. Look at look at the back. The back is the looks like the back of an alpaca. It's a back alpaca. <laughs> and what's really cool about these is that they're all washable. So you got a zipper bag if you want to take your project to the beach, or it's not even doesn't even have to be for your knitting projects. It can be for anything you want. But so this little alpaca my bag bag. Uh, we'll go for $10. So if you want the alpaca bag, just let us know. And we'll hold it aside here. You can think about it. Put it Leslie Welsh Flaherty says, bag is mine. <laughs> okay, Gloria Hamilty says, yay, can't wait. <laughs> well, good. So I'm, I, I know I'm not going to be able to keep up, but I do have our timestamp. And uh, but there were a couple of questions the other night about who got what when. And what I do is just go back to the timestamp because we look at every comment as it comes in and um, and 
whenever you want something, make sure you list what it is, you say what it is. Oh, I want that doesn't help us because we don't know what that was. <laughs> and then I had to scratch my head and wonder, what was I talking about then? And so, so the alpaca bag is going to wet. Uh, to Lovely Wells like, Flaherty. Congratulations. <laughs> the alpaca, alpaca, your bags, because you're ready to go. Perfect. Perfect. Your bag is packed. You're ready to go. All right. So um, I don't think I brought these out the other night. And um, there's a there's a company, I'm trying to remember where the heck they are. Yes, they are in St. Louis, Missouri, a company called um, the American North American Surrey Company in Salt River Mills. Salt River Mills um, has these beautiful Surrey alpaca yarns. And uh, they are, these are a sport weight. It's 75% Surrey and 25% wool. There's 280 grams on a hank and um i have i have a couple of different options here i have the cool sorbet three skeins and then the potter's clay is you know if you look at them you realize that they're different one is a little deeper one is more coral one is more rust so Potter's Clay and Cool Sorbet, write those down. And then we have a trio of navy and gold. It's upside down, the first one. Oh, it's not really upside down. Okay, there you go. The label's upside down. The yarn can go either way. So we have the trio, the... Oh, the cool sorbet and the potter's clay. And they're eight, they're going as, as sets. So it makes life a lot easier when we do it that way. Lila Foster, happy Thanksgiving, friends. Happy Thanksgiving to you, Lila. Thanks, Lila. Um, okay, so each trio is 24.75. So you have uh, almost 900, three, six, 900 yards of, um, of Surrey alpaca and wool for 24.75. Again, the colors are cool sorbet. The trio. Anna Maria, Potter's Clay sold. And the Potter's Clay. Okay, I'm going to take it away so it doesn't go anywhere. Anna Maria's not taking any chances this time. <laughs> Fingers weren't fast enough last time. Perfect. Thanks, Anna Maria. So I'll hold these here. If anybody else is interested, just let me know. Um, Karen Rhodes, happy Thanksgiving. And Helen Solenberger, happy Thanksgiving to well, everyone. Happy Thanksgiving, Hope all is well. Everybody. Lila Foster shared. Thanks, Lila. Um, so, by the way, I speaking of Lila Foster sharing, I noticed that there are some of you who share all the time, and I really do appreciate that. It helps us, and um, our our fans are growing, our business is growing, and that's all thanks to you. So, I, we appreciate everything that you do to keep the keep the world knowing about us. Anna Marie Milani, you got it, Paul. <laughs> okay, so here, um, this bag is totally is unopened. It's a lovely multicolor. This is Harvest Tweed by Reynolds. And let me tell you what we have here. We have um, a 63% wool, 17% acrylic, 14% mohair, 6% nylon. We have 93 um, yards on a ball and there are 10 balls in here. And the 10 balls will be at $2 a piece. You get the whole bag for $20. Whoa, did you say $2 a I piece did. for a bag of $20? I did. Wow. Bag is $20. It's Harvest Tweed. It is a wool, acrylic, mohair, and nylon. Um, 10 times 9. So you have 900, a little better than 900 yards on here. What could you make with that? You could oh, you can make a vest. You can make a hat, a scarf, a cowl. You know, you can do a, a trio of things, um, a sweater. 
You can do a piece of a, a pillow cover. There's lots of things you can do with nine nine hundred yards. You can you can actually do a sweater, uh, depending on the size. And I'm just I'm gonna let me check the weight on this. Rochelle one. Worth Price, what weight is it? I'm just looking right now, sweetheart. Let me see. Please stand by. We're checking the weight oh, now. I have that listed. Hold on. I will tell you in a moment. Please hold the camera to again to see the color. It's a. I, I didn't want to open the bag because it hasn't been opened at all yet. So it's oranges, red, gray. It's really pretty fall multicolor. Bryce wonders worsted. No, no, no. I don't think so. I'm checking it out right now. Oh well, you know what? It says bulky. Yep, that's what it says here, and I'm looking at the, uh, yeah, on a size 9 needle. On a size 9 needle, so you've got 15 stitches and 19 rows on size 9 needles. So, yeah, that is, it's a bulky, a bulky weight. So you have 900 yards of bulky weight. Perfect, see color well. Excellent. So this, this bag is $20. I'm just going to put it right up there. Let me put here bulky so I know if we still have it tomorrow. Okay, perfect. There we go. Um, let's see, what do I want to talk about next? Oh, we have two of these left from the other day from, um, from Cozy Color Works. We have two skeins left of the... Um, this, this ones that we had the other day, we have, they're both fingering weight. They're about 550 yards and they are each $15. So we have Goldenrod and Smoky Mountain are the colors that are left there. And I found this lovely, oh my goodness, if you love to knit for babies, I found these great mint green just such a pretty soft soft green color uh these are 550 yards of fingering weight they're the two of them together i don't know what you want me to do there we go <laughs> so this is called mint and the the skeins are 14 dollars a piece for these two because these are 28 dollars skeins Lila Foster sold harvest tweed. Okay. Is that, that one? Yep. Yep. So Congratulations, Lila Foster. Move that out of the way. Cool. Cool. All right. So I'm going to put these two little fingering weights, the, the mint juleps here with the others. These are 15 each. These are 14 each. And I also have a worsted weight in the same mint julep color. So on the worsted weight, we have, thank you, Paul. We have 200 yards per skein. So you've got 400 yards. That'll make a cute little baby, like a car blanket, a car seat blanket. Laura Ginovelli Cooper, is the baby yarn machine washable? Um, well, it is. Um, I would think that it, well, let's just say this. It's a super wash merino. So yes, it's machine washable. I would be careful with the, you know, I wouldn't put it in a high dryer. You know, in fact, I probably wouldn't put it in a dryer. That's me, though. You could probably put it in a low, a low dryer and it'll be fine. So, yes, it's a super wash right there, super wash merino. So, same thing on the worsted weight. Super wash merino. Sue Meek, hello from Eucla, California. Hi, Sue. I hope you're doing well out there. Eucla, that's... <laughs> Is that UCLA? <laughs> uh, you, it could be. Laura G. and Van Cooper. Okay, I'll take a skein. Of which one, Laura? You need to tell us the name. Mint julep. And if you want mint julep, you want the fingering. Mint fingering or mint worsted. We need to know. Which one is it, Laura? Mm 
<laughs> okay. Well, while Laura is letting us know, we have some other little goodies here. Um, I'm going to go here. You know, these were really popular. And Laura says mint julep worsted. Okay. All righty. Let me put Laura on this while, it, while it's nice and... Uh, I said, we have the time. Thank you, Laura. Thank you, Laura. Thank you very much. So Katya uh, put out this, this fun yarn called Paint. And um, it's a cake. On the cake, you have... Two, two, two. Let me see here. On the cake, we have 590 yards. You see the colors, how they how they change throughout. And one cake makes the scarf. Two cakes makes the larger scarf. Now I have, let me show you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three cakes full. So I'm put this here. And show you what I have. So now these are the so you know. We have here eighty percent acrylic, twenty percent wool. So yes, these are very machine washable. And um, we have two cakes of the blue, and they would be nine dollars each. And one cake of the pink for nine dollars. Two cakes makes the big scarf. One cake makes the small scarf. So $9 each, you can say paint blue or paint pink. And I will include the pattern. And if you want the two blues, let me know. So it's paint blue and paint pink. Paint blue and paint pink. Those are fun. The last, the last three I have left. All righty. Oh, these are, you know, we had some, we had people who were, I want one of those, I want one of those, and they were gone last week. So, um, and I mentioned to you that I might have more on the bus. Helen Solenberger, paint blue too. Paint blue too. Those are gone. You got it, Helen. And we have one paint pink left. One paint pink left. Makes that scarf. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. All righty. Uh, so I started saying these little indulgence mini kits. These are fun. You, there's a, 152 skeins uh, of yards on each skein. It's a... Um, I believe these are. Helen Solenberger, thank you. Lila Foster, this is so fun. Oh, we have just begun, Lila. <laughs> so here, these are DK weights. This is a fun little pattern here, but you can also mix these together. You can mix you you can mix bags together to create your own little kits too. So these normally sold for $49.99. I actually made a mistake the other night and charged $20 instead of $25 for them. So you are all going to continue to get them for $20 for a kit. Whoa, this reminds me of Monopoly. Bank error in your favor. Bank you collect error. $20. That's correct. You collect $5 on those. So I want to find I want to find what I have here. Helen Solenberger, this is safe Black Friday shopping. This is it is safe. It is safe Black Friday shopping. And I want to make sure that I find, okay, my indulgence mini. So I'm trying to find where I have those. I have them all listed with how many I have left of each one. Hold on a minute, guys. I'm very sorry. Okay, indulgence mini. Oh, okay, here. Desert Rose with the pink and grays. I only have one. So Desert Rose, I have one. Then we have Canterbury Ivy is another. This is such a fun combination. The Canterbury Ivy, I have one as well. Then. How much are those? They're $20. Laguna Bay. There are two.
I Leslie Welsh Flaherty, what is the correct, the, what is the content and yardage? Okay, the content, each, each skein is 153 yards, so you have a total of 600 yards. The content is, um, these are, are these merino? Yes, they're 100% superwash wool. 100% superwash wool, DK weight, 153 yards per mini skein, 600 yards on the, in the kit. So let me show you the colors. I'll say them again. Riverside Sun, Laguna Bay, Desert Rose. I'm down so they can see them. I'd like the pink gray minis, please. Leslie Welsh Flaherty. Okay, Leslie, they're yours. Congratulations and thank you. Leslie Welsh Flaherty, Desert Rose. Yep, that's it. That's the Desert Rose. And then here are your other colors. Um, we have this is this one as well. This is Purple Rain. I should lay Antoinette that. Kellum, good evening, everyone. Happy Thanksgiving. Good evening, Antoinette, and happy Thanksgiving to you as well. Diane Caracello Carmichael, Laguna Bay, please. Laguna Bay. And Leslie Welsh Flaherty, thank you. No, thank you. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. All righty. Um, we have, and if you're, if you're still thinking, take your time because we have, you know, we have time. Um, you know, the ones that we have left. Riverside Sun. Lila Foster, Purple Rain. Purple Rain. Purple Rain. Thank you, Lila. more organized than it was the other night you all you're over you're, you're, it's it still be, early it must be turkey it must be you know the turkeys what is that the tryptophan tryptophan yeah the tryptophan syndrome <laughs> okay so we're gonna put those there because we still have some of those left perfect thank you we uh purple rain oh we got a laguna bay okay good all right all right so we have some other goodies here um, I don't know. I don't think I've had these even out in the shot for you to see. This is a product called Lustra. Lustra is a Barocco yarn. And what we have here is 197 yards of Peruvian wool. Helen Solenberger, or we will have a little too much holiday cheer. <laughs> we have a combination of Peruvian wool and Tencel. The Tencel gives it a little shine there. Uh, this is a worsted weight. These are great for, I've seen these, I've seen these made in sweaters and um, like a lacy, a lacy knit shawl. Very, very pretty. Uh, again, it's called Lustra. It's a worsted weight normally sells for $14 a skein. You have 191. So you have about 200 yards on a skein. So what I do, I have, I have just small quantities of each left. So let me show you what I have and I'm going to sell them by the set. Hold on a second. Lila Foster, what is the aqua and green mini, please? The aqua and green mini. Aqua. Well, let me show you the colors that are left. You tell me which one. We have Riverside Sun. And we have Canterbury Ivy or Violet Hill. So you decide which one of those, because I don't know what your, you know, what everybody calls colors different. And maybe what you chose was gone already. I don't know. Okay, what were you saying about So let these? me set these out. I'm going to set these out because I'm we're selling them by lots. Lila Foster of Violet Hill. Got it. Always working that nitty-gritty yarn girl. Okay. So, let me show you how I'm doing this. 
There Thank are, you, Lila. These will be seven dollars per skein. And remember, they're 197 yards per skein. So we one, two, three, four, five. So two times five, you have a thousand yards here at seven dollars. Seven. This is thirty-five dollars. This one is fifteen. We have two blues for fourteen. Two teals for fourteen. And one navy. So rust. How many skeins are those? These three three here. So rust is twenty-one dollars. Purple thirty-five. Let's call that blue. 14 for two. Teal, 14 for two. Navy, seven for one. Really pretty combination is to put these together and use your blue as an accent color, either on your trim on the outside or as an accent throughout. So these are lovely, great holiday wear, great for denim. These, you know, really just a very, very pretty. And there's a sheen to it. I don't know if you can see the sheen there um, in the camera. Just that little bit of that tensile uh, gives it a really nice sheen. Okay, so you may have seen as we're just we're going to keep moving along. As something comes up into the in the um, in the comments, we will certainly attend to it as it pops up, and we uh, as we need to. I'm seeing Ben. Speaking of needing, Ben is being needy. Uh, so you all have seen this Penelope shawl. I wanted to use this as a demonstration to to show you how pretty the yarns that I'm going to bring out to your attention now work up. So these yarns are Wasco DK, and they come in a multicolor as well as tonals. And so we've got, we have a good variety of some of these colors and not so many of others. So let me tell you what we've got here. Let me find my Wasco DK. Here we go. All right. So we have stripes, tonals, and multis in these. Don't cover up that box, nitty gritty. Uh, we'll see about that box. I'm not sure about that box tonight. Um, you know me. I'm always feeling very generous when it comes to that. Okay. So, tonals. We have the... Oh, these are... Let me tell you what these are selling for here now. And, and let me tell you what you've got. So, you have 310 yards of DK. It's 100% wool. And... Let me see if there's anything else. Extra fine merino. Yeah. And so these usually sell for uh, $23. So what does $23 come out to? 12 and 12 is 24. So let's call it, let's call it $11.50. Let's call them $11.50. You know what? $11. I hate change at the end of these things. So $11 a skein. On the blue... We have uh, plenty of these. So if you want the blue, let me know. The red, tell me how many you want and I'll let you know what we've got. So in our tonals, we have blue and we have red. And then these multis are just so pretty. There's the red and purple. And then there's the orange and green and the green and purple. So let me show you what I love to do with these because, you know, there's so many ways you can work them together. So when you look at the Penelope shawl, this is the multicolor in it. And then we use purple, which we are out of completely, but the red works great with it. So the purple, uh, the red works wonderfully with the red and purple. Ben wants to go on the sofa. I know he does. 
You can put the red with the green. And then there's even this purple and the green go great together as well. There's also the blue stripe that goes really nicely with the blue. And I'm going to, I'm reviewing these so that you can see, I'm going to show them to you now. And then I'm going to go over them again. And then there's the red. See, so everything really works so nicely together. Diane Carcello Carmichael, orange and green mini times two, please. Orange and green times it two. It says orange and green mix two, please. Yes. Perfect. Come here, Ben. There you go. Ben's a needy boy tonight. Yeah, well, he likes to be a needy boy. You wanted two of these? I'm going to grab two right now for you. And who was that, Paul? That was Diane Caracello Carmichael. You got it. Antoinette Kellum, two multi-orange and purple. Two multi-orange and purple. Perfect. That's Antoinette Kellum. Okay. Lila Foster, the two purple mix. What two purple mix? I don't know what that means. Oh. Do you mean this? The purple and the purple tonal? And you want one of each of those? This it's a really pretty combination. That's gorgeous. And there's also this. You can do it with the green. What a pretty three. Oh, that's really a beautiful combination there. Which one's Lila? Lila says yes. These two. You got it. If you want to throw the green in, let me know. So I'm going to, you know what? I'm going to put Lila's. Did you write it down? Um, here, I'm going to do this because like that. This way I know. I'm putting your names on the, uh, on the labels. It makes life a lot easier. All right, so we start. Lila out. Foster, okay, the green too. <laughs> okay, Lila. <laughs> you drive a hard bargain. I'm telling you. Anna Maria Milani, what is needed to make scarf? Um, of this, let me tell you. Let me let me take a peek at this, sweetie. Um, so they're they're 300 yards, and so if you're gonna make a scarf, I mean, it all depends. You're gonna make it with cables, or you're gonna make it. Um, you know, just straight knit. Um, I would say you'd need a minimum of 600 yards for a scarf. So let me see. Hold on a minute. I can, where did my phone go? Hold on. I have a little app to help me with that. There's an app for that. I want to make a scarf and I'm using, um, hold on. Anna Maria, the one you showed. Was that the scarf you just showed? Oh, to make the Penelope. Oh, hold on. Hold on, please. That I can show you with no problem. My phone is ringing. The phone is in your hand. No, no, I know what that is. Go away, you. Okay, so let me tell you here. Penelope, Penelope. Two of each color makes that scarf. And, um, So eleven ten dollars each, so it'll be forty dollars. And this and the kit on our website sells for seventy nine nine seventy one ninety nine. So the kit takes the 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 scarf takes two of each color. I think you need a little piece of paper to write Lila Foster's name on from before and put it in the box. 
The magic box. Oh, the sharing box? Yes. <laughs> the magic box. <laughs> it's like the magic window. <laughs> okay. All right. So I'm going to pull some of those other colors back out here so we have them so you can see what they're like here. And this is take. Did somebody take the blue? No. So we have the purples. We have red. We have the purple and red. This is such a pretty combination. I just love this. Really so sweet. And then the green stripe. We still have more of the green stripe if you like that. Hold on. I missed what you just did. Oh. I was looking at comments. That's okay. So these two work. You know, you can put the red with either the green or with the purple. You can do the blue solid and the blue stripe. And then I can't reach the green that's up there. But that's the other. This one? Yeah. And the, oh, that purple there, Paul. That one? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't get them all. Did I get them all? I could have sworn I brought that down. Apparently not. I did not. Let me grab that. Hold on, everyone. Wait till you see how I do this. Can you grab it just from there? Oh, look at you. Oh, no. It went down. <laughs> you want the other? <laughs> well, how many do you want? I would, yes, just bring down whatever you can. All right. <laughs> that was funny. And one more. And then there's a the green. You want to bring down a green one so the folks can see it. I never did well at those carnival games. <laughs> Apparently not. And let's see if we can get this one down. Perfect. Okay. Just so that they can see. All right. So let me get this back here. So you can do the purple with the green and purple. Ooh. Two skeins each if you wanted to make Penelope. You could do the purple with the red, which is exactly what we have in the shawl that I showed you. This exact same color combination. I'm going to show that shawl one more time. Show the shawl. Show the shawl. Let me show the shawl. Hold on. Short rows. Narrow on one end. Long on the other. Ugh. Cool. Cooler roof. So, $10 each, they're yours. Just tell us how many you need. Alrighty. You know what? You got to add a name in there. Okay. You got to write it down. Lila, Lila Foster. You mean another one since we've been on the show? Yes. Yeah, all right. Just making sure. We want to make sure none of our fans miss out. I just feel, I think we need a break. So I think a little. Um... Lila Foster said, that is so sweet. She must be referring to the camera guy. Oh, oh. I missed it. I missed the bucket. Going in. She's going in. Susan Hewitt D. Olivers. Hello. Hello, Susan Hewitt D. Olivers. And the winner is Antoinette Kellum. Antoinette Kellum. Yay! Congratulations. I love when somebody wins who's actually on the show at the time. Yay, Antoinette. Hooray. And, and you all know that I'm still in that same giving mood that I was on uh, Monday. So when you order from our sale, from our pop-up sale, in your package, there will be an extra skein of yarn, a special hand-spun yarn, and a limited edition. So that is for all of you when you purchase with Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl. Julie Denny Stark. Hooray. Helen Solenberger. Congratulations. And Antoinette Kellum. 
Yeah. Yeah, Antoinette. Good for you, hon. Good for you. If I don't have your address, make sure that you message that to me. All right. So we've got that. If Anne Marie, if you decide you want some of those um the Wasco DKs, let me know the colors that you like. Remember, you need four, two of each color to make to make that shawl if that's what you're interested in. Okay. Um, oh. Laura Giannavelli Cooper, awesome. You guys rock. Helen Solenberger, thank you. So kind of you. Okay. You're very welcome. Antoinette Kellum, thank you. So we have this fun yarn by que uh, Queensland Collection, Queensland United. This is 1,531 yards of fingering weight. Well, actually sport weight, not fingering weight. Uh, lamb's wool, organic lamb's wool and cotton, lovely cakes of yarn. It comes with a pattern. Ooh, comes with a pattern that we have. Um, for Queensland United, the cake works up lovely. And I just want to see if I can find that pattern really fast for you. We've got, actually, I have one of each, just those colors that are left there. And that's it. Only these two left. The final few. Susan Meek, I'll take the one dark purple and the one purple green on the DK. Dark purple and purple green. You got it. Dark, one dark purple and one purple green of the DK. And who was that? That was Susan Meek. I think she's from California. Yep. Putting your name on it here, Susan. So I don't forget. Thank you, Susan. Um, okay, hold on here. This is good. Ben, what are you doing, boy? Okay, so we do have a pattern to go with that. And that's what I was looking for for you. And, and it's not coming up. And that's what's annoying me. Well, the... One ball makes a, it's a square wrap, if I can remember correctly. So one ball makes the full wrap, and there's over 1,500 yards there of organic cotton and lamb's wool. Uh, the other night we had the infinity shawls. This is what we have left. We have one teal. So Type quick if you want it. We have the blue, red, and the tan. Teal, blue. Hold on, start again. Teal, blue, red, tan. And those are, the sale price on those is $20. Gina Bates, what's the price? The fifteen hundred. The oh, thirteen. And you have only two of those left, I have right? One and one. One orange, one pink. Okay. So, Queensland United. And then the infinity shawls. Judy Lightfoot, infinity teal. Hey, Judy Lightfoot. We got it. Um, Gina Bates, Judy beat me, LOL. <laughs> and I only had one of the teal. I. I knew somebody was going to have to be quick on the trigger for that one. So that yeah, means it's just have, three of these. Yep, left. That's we still it. have those left. Yep. 
Okay, that's and that comes with a pattern too. So I have that pattern for you as well. Um, that comes with it. Okay, so I'm gonna come back here to some of these hand dyes that we have. Um, and these are fun. I, I just love these. They're, I'm selling them each separately. So if you if you see what you like, uh, be quick on these because I have I have three. Julie Lightfoot, cheers. This is um, Anzula, Anzula's Burley. So they're thirty four dollars. Normally thirty four dollars a skein. So that would be what uh, da, 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 seventeen dollars. Seventeen dollars each. This is a super wash merino, cashmere and nylon, a hundred yards. Gina Bates, can you show the infinity shawl when you get a chance? Yes, I will show the infinity shawl as soon as I can. Um, so um, I'll do that as soon as I'm done with these. So the print, so Anzula super wash merino, cashmere and nylon, hundred yards. Normally sells for thirty four seventeen dollars. I have three skeins. I have one purple, one orange, and one gray. So $17, purple, orange, or gray. Then we go to another Anzula. And this is Croquette. Croquette is a DK. And the DK is 230 yards. This is a 50% superwash merino, 50% silk. And here we have uh, $35. So we're going to just call that 18. Well, you know what? Let's call it 17. We'll keep it simple, the same as we did for the others. We're calling that $17 for these for the cricket. So cricket brown, cricket green. Oh, sorry, croquet, but that's okay. You can call it cricket. I'll know what you mean. Let's keep my head simple. And cricket multi. Then we have another DK that's really called Cricket. Oh, stop it. And the difference, the difference between the Cricket and the, and the Croquet, just so you know, is the Croquet is 50% Marine, Superwash Marina, 50% Silk. The Cricket is 80% Superwash, 10% Nylon. So they're, they both have Superwash Merino. So I would say that you could easily put them into, you know, a soft, a soft wash. But look how pretty these three colors go together. Really a fun mixture here. So each one is $17. And you can say Anzula Purple. Anzula Multi. Anzula Green. Anzula Brown. And I'm going to put Anzula out here so you can see. That's the name of the company. So these are all DK weights. The other Anzulas up here are all bulkies. Great for hats, mittens, cowls, 100 yards. Right? Those are 100 yards in each one. Yeah, 100 yards. And then to top the Anzula list, we have a lovely little sparkle. This is a fingering or sock weight yarn by Anzula. Can they see the sparkle in there? Can you oh, see yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Really, I can see the sparkle. Very, very pretty. So this is a... Gina Bates, I'm watching this and cooking dinner. Oops. <laughs> So this is a superwash merino and a sparkling Stella. Um, I'm sorry, Stellina, which is um, where it gets that little sparkle from. 
And the, again, this is a fingering weight. So that's 400 yards. This would make a really pretty shawlette for the holidays. Something really soft and, you know, something sparkly to go on your with your little favorite black dress or something. Uh, 400 yards. It's just enough to get something soft and, and delicate out of. So this is a $28. So that would be $14 for the Anzula Sparkle. I'm going to just mark that here so I have it. So I don't forget what I'm saying here. These are 17. Cool. All righty. The top rainbow we showed the other night. If you're new to the show tonight, top rainbow is a, uh, a cotton yarn by Katia. You can see the multiple strands in there that work out, work up as a sport weight yarn. These are multicolor cakes, or I should say gradient cakes. This grades from, from your, your ecru or tan to a lovely lime brown in there. Just such a pretty, pretty color combination. These are um, the last two cakes we have. And this is a 50% cotton, 50% acrylic. The yardage on this is 874 yards. So you get a lovely scarf out of that. Let me show you the pattern that goes with this. Oh, here it is. So one, one skein, one cake makes this shawl. Two cakes will make the poncho because the poncho is really just two, two shawls sewn together. And then there's also a crochet pattern and that crochet pattern takes one cake. So that's your Katia top rainbow. And don't forget to show the infinity shawl. Yeah, for the Dina infinity Bates. shawl. Let me just grab that, guys. Hold on one quick minute. And Anna Maria Milani, can you show the angular bulky colors again? The Anzula bulky colors, Paul. The, the, the orange, the gray, and the one that's next to it there. Anzula. Getting that for you right now. The fastest way to get it is to just for me to go to the website for it. Now, did you want to see the Anzula, Anna Maria, or do you want the Anzula? Not sure what your comment means. I think she just wanted to see the colors. Okay, here it comes. The Infinity Shaw. Anna Maria Milani, I'll take the bulky gray and purple for a hat, of course. <laughs> Which, uh, so that's gray this gray and, the purple. and this okay. purple. Anna Maria. Okay, let me write that. Does Anna Maria know what size hat I wear? I think she does. <laughs> I think you might have told her a couple of times <laughs> what size hat you wear. I think you might have told her way too many times what size hat you wear. Gina Bates, colors for the infinity shawl, please. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, Anna Marie. Well, I missed. Did you show the Infinity Shawl? I'm get, I'm printing it oh, now. Oh, got it, got it. I thought I was losing it. And she wants to have colors for the Infinity Shawl. Yeah, and yep. I'm going to show them to her as well. We've got the technology. Everything is right here. Um. 
Anna Maria Milani, I got you, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> Gina Bates, thanks, guys. I'm telling you, don't, 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 don't. Gina, what are you making for dinner? Okay, Paul, can you come? Can you come around here for a moment? Okay, so the the Queensland, the organic cotton and wool. This is the shawl pattern for that. So that's the cake that is the, they have one orange and one gray or pink, pink and gray. So that's the pattern that comes with that. Gina Bates is making turkey. I should have known. This is the infinity shawl. So let's walk back over so I can show them the colors. So watch, don't fall. Thank you. You're supposed to say walk this way, and then I walk that way. There you go. So here's your infinity shawl patterns. It, it's a, um, this is an asymmetrical triangle here, kind of an accordion design. And then you also have the other that you can do as well, a little more lacy. Both patterns are included. I always want to make sure that I have the right. Yeah, so one cake makes either one. So that's the infinity shawl. These are the colors we have left. Navy, red, or tan. Go slow with them. Navy. Yeah. So the navy go comes down to a deep rose in the middle. The red is a you know is a kind of a red and black. And then the tan goes to, uh, a, again, from tan or like an off-white and then a gradient tan into the pink or rose pink. And the sale price on those is 20. I hope that was helpful. Okay. So the, the other night I showed you some um, interlacements yarns and um, it was, they were fingering weights. And I just, again, I love the, um, the yarns that Tracy shoe dyes. She does such a great job. This is what Gina Bates. Dang, pick one for me. I can't decide. <laughs> Diane Coracello Carmichael, infinity Navy, please. Okay. Well, I don't know. How about know, the red Gina? one for Gina? Gina, the last thing you bought was off white. So I'm thinking I'd go with something a little more colorful. How about the red, Gina? We have, there's another navy. But there's another navy. Yeah. Diane Carmichael? Yep. Diane Caracello Carmichael. Mm -hmm. Infinity Navy, please. Julie Denny Sark, the navy is beautiful, Diane Car <laughs> Caracello Carmichael. Yeah, I have another navy. I know I do because I. Um, wait, Gina me... Bates says yes, but I'm not sure what she says yes to. Wait a minute, let me find it. Gina Bates, oh wait, Gina Bates, navy. <laughs> okay. Now you better find that navy, no, nitty gritty. I know I have it. I know I have it. Navy. Hooray! Gina Bates, navy. Gina Bates, I'm so confused. <laughs> Welcome to my world, Gina. So, all right, let's go back to this. I was showing you all this lovely gray wool. Oh, you know, we've gone over an hour. All right, give me two more things. All righty. Okay, because these are, we don't know who's going to be on tomorrow, but we know who's on tonight. So let's get you all, look how pretty. This is, this is Tippy Toes. This is, um, and interlacements, this is their sock weight yarn, their sock yarn. This is an 88% superwash wool, 12% nylon. And I just think this gray and white is one of the sharpest things I've seen. I just love these colors. This normally sells for $24. You on here you have 400 yards, superwash wool and nylon. 
for $12. So I'm going to wrap that back up. It's called Gray Wolf. Gray Wolf. And I have a couple of feather light. Yep. Hold on. We've got a message incoming. Lila Foster, that is gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? I love it. Absolutely love it. So the Gray Wolf, um, not Gray Wolf, sorry. This is Fledge. We're just going to call this Featherlight Fledge. This is another uh, hand-painted fiber by Blue Moon Fibers. It's 430 yards, and it is a 100% merino wool fingering weight. I have two of them. Again, these are hand-dyed, so you can see the colors um, are not exact. As you, I mean, I think this is important, you know, when you're buying hand dyed yarns, because it's not like buying a mass producer on where your colors are all exactly the same running through. So you can see, aren't they pretty? Look how nice that is. Reminds me of a, of a tie dye denim. Susan Meek, I'll take the gray wolf. You take the gray wolf. You got it. Is that Susan the gray wolf? Meek. No, the gray oh. wolf is right back there. Yep. So we have two of these Featherlight fledges. If anyone is interested, um, they are $13 each. This is Susan Meek. Susan Meek. So what I wanted to be sure to show you all tonight before we sign off for the night, I have two skeins of Art Yarns Merino Cloud. Antoinette Kellum, pretty. These, this was not a set, but they actually work really lovely together. You can see the, the little hint of purple in there and or fuchsia and then this fuchsia. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sell them as a set, but I have one of each color here. So this is um these are $21 each, and this is merino cloud. 242 fuchsia merino cloud fuchsia and merino cloud let's call that aqua so merino cloud fuchsia merino cloud aqua and i think that's going to be it for tonight an hour goes awfully fast I think I pulled a name, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> Paul's trying to get me to take another name. My goodness, it's not it's not Christmas, it's Thanksgiving. <laughs> so, no. Well, we're thank we're saying thanks, and that's why we're giving. Right. We are saying thank you, and we are very appreciative of all of you being here. And so if there's something that you saw tonight and you, you know, you think about it after the show, feel free to send me a message either in Messenger or you can call me at 203-856-6755. Or you can um, send me an email at paulette at nittygrittyyarngirl.com. Susan Meek, I'll take the Merino Cloud Aqua. Anna Munford, what kind of projects could I do with the Aqua? None. We just showed. Uh, <laughs> none right now, Anna, because it's just gone. Susan Lila Meek. Foster. Oh, so soon. Anna Munford. Never mind. <laughs> LOL. And Anna Maria Milani. So thankful to have you guys in my life. We love you, Anna Maria. Wait a minute. Susan Meek, right? Yes. Okay. Let me put this here with us so I don't lose it. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> You got to learn from Anna Maria. She's a little quicker on the type this evening. <laughs> she learned last time. Oh, that was funny. That was funny. Uh <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Gina Goldrich, Husco DK green and purple with the purple and Zula Malta and green. Whoa, okay. Whoa. All right. All right. Let me. Hold on. Right. Back up there, Nitty Gritty. So you, I, I'm thinking. Wasco, dark green and purple. Wasco, dark green and purple. Wait a minute. I know where it is. I know where it is. Hold on. Don't even try to climb on the table. Emergency rooms are full right now. And I'm not going to them. 
Oh, good. I believe that's it. That's Hosco dark green and purple. Right. With the purple and Zula multi and green. Okay. So are you saying all three of these? Is that what you're saying, Jillian? In the meantime, Helen Solenberger says, thank you again for a fun time. No, thank you, Helen. We love having you on the show. Love you, Helen. Jillian Goldrich says, yes. Okay, so you've got these three and this one, and we're good to go. I didn't even, Jillian, I didn't even know you were on. You've been sitting there really quietly for the past hour. I'm, oh. I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> Lila Foster, thank you both for such a fun evening. Another great one. Thank you all. <laughs> Let you know, I want you to know that on the things oh. that, what? Jillian Goldrich, no, purple, Wasco. Isn't this purple? Oh, this purple. I thought she said purple and green. Uh, that's what I read. Wasco, dark green and purple. Jillian, no. Jillian Goldrich, no. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Maybe these two. <laughs> Are those the ones, Jillian? Oh, and Lila Foster says, working a 12 tomorrow, so we'll miss. Oh, we'll miss you, too. Yeah, we will miss you. But we'll be back Saturday, Lila, at 6 o'clock. Oops. Jillian Goldrich, Huasco, one purple, one. What? Huasco, one purple, one, and one, and green, and purple. Yes, I think that's what she means. And Judy Lightfoot, could I have the infinity with the cream on the outside? <laughs> that sounds like how I like my ice cream, with cream on the outside. Whipped cream, that is. <laughs> oh, my God. And Jillian Goldrich says, green and purple and purple. <laughs> yes, I got it. I think we got it. I think it. we got it. And then these three. Okay, let me put this But in. wait, there's more. Wait, wait. <laughs> You better write that down. I got it. It's right in there. All right. But are you sure you know who it is? Uh, Jillian. Jillian. Okay. Uh, Susan Hewitt Dorvillers, if you have four, two purple, and two green. What's four, two purple, and two green? Four, two purple, and two green. Uh, you want this kind of purple and green? Or do you want? And Jillian said yes. So she's okay. confirmed. Shoo. Hold on. And Susan says, and purple, I'll take them. So Susan says, if you have four, two, uh, four, two purple and two green. Right. But we, I, I need to know, do you mean these two green? Oh, hold on a second. Um, <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> All right, so Susan says, and purple, I'll take them. I need to, I, I'm going to have to contact her or look at what, what she's asking because I'm not sure. I don't want to say I do or don't have. And Jillian Goldrich says, then Anzula multi and Anzula green. Okay, so you don't want the Anzula purple. <coughs> and Susan Hewitt said, the one you made the shawl with. Okay, I'll be with you in one second, Susan Hewitt. You have Jillian's phone number, right? Oh, yeah, I can get to Jill. Okay, so the ones I made the shawl with. Exactly. Jillian, uh, Nitty Gritty Yarn Girl will call you right after the show so we can make sure we get exactly what you want. Purple and red. And then that other purple. Does and there Susan a purple said the shawl? one you made the shawl with. Right. But I, th I think the last I purple. think you are out of the purple. I'm out of the purple, but I do have I do have the red to go with it. Does the red work, Susan? I believe I have two of those. You want to show her those? Yep. I'll have to look and see. Jillian says, sounds good. I think that's referring to your calling her after the yeah. show. Yeah, yeah. 
think that's the best way. Good idea. Yeah, I have to see what I have left on this. Um, I will, I will um, message who. I'm sorry, I don't know. That's who, Susan Su Hewitt Dorviller. All right, Susan, let me um, check my inventory and see if I have more, because um, we moved pretty quickly there toward the end, and I want to make sure that I, I don't overpromise and then not be able to deliver. So, um, I have your I have your comments here in the comment section after the show. I will go through the colors and see uh, if I don't have the the um the purple stripe or the purple tonal i do have i may have the red susan says no problem okay sir perfect okay now, do you have her contact info or no no i don't i'm gonna have to reply to her on okay. in in the so susan keep an eye on the comment section i'll reply to your comment or you can message me in messenger with your contact information okay i think that's it tonight i am sufficiently exhausted there's so much more on this table to show you all. Um, but for the meantime, we're going to sign off tonight. Know that among all the things we are thankful for, you all are on the top of our list. Thank you so much for being oh, with us. You. We will see you tomorrow. And Paul has something else to say. <laughs> uh, Susan says the letter S. Okay. We'll talk to you later. See you later. Bye. Have a great night.